She's nearly bald. She's also lacking eyebrows and eyelashes. Hmm, she's also got quite a small jaw and has no teeth. What could this be? Empty eyes with no more tears to The child had not been growing for the past year and was shorter than the average year old child. The face was also shrunken and wrinkly, a large head with a small face. His, uh, his skin had no elasticity. It seemed the child was growing rapidly afterwards. Crying, Jesus, help me to see the morning light of one more day. But if I should die before I wake, I pray my soul to take. Can you feel the hearts of the children? Doctor, doctor, what's wrong with my baby? Your child is diagnosed with HGPS, which is short for Hutchinson Gilford Progeria Syndrome. It is a rare disease where there is genetic mutation in the DNA. It is unknown where the disease originates from or what causes the mutation. Are our children the first to be diagnosed with progeria? I am unsure of that. I have some parents here with a child with progeria. Could you tell us some background information about it? Of course. One child in a million is likely to be diagnosed with progeria, and now that I look at the medical records, only a hundred children have been diagnosed. The disease usually shows itself in a child between two to three years old. As of now, there is about 78 children diagnosed with it, but the relatives and family of the patient do not show symptoms. Thank you. That is all, John. You're welcome. Always glad to help. Is there no any cures or treatments? or anything that can prevent this for our future children? Unfortunately, there are no cures or any ways to prevent progeria because it is a genetic disease. Some treatments would be low-dose aspirin or a high-bypass surgery. Although these will not prevent your child from experiencing hip dislocation, stiff joints, heart attacks, or- STROKE! <laughs> no! No! So my baby will probably die from a stroke? Can you Silence in the shadows. 